Today we're going to fix the tranny leak and the speedometer. The parts I got, which are the pretty much the same thing that's on there now. That was cross-threaded. And the this piece was broke. Which is kind of like a speed cable. Except for this one is digital. Here's the parts. It's this one here. You got the seal there. Seal there. So there's part number. There you go. So this is for the electric speedos, non-cable. It's pretty universal. You should be able to do that. <coughs> it should work on most meters. I would have to, uh, if I was you had to read the description, but um, from what I know, they're pretty universal. So hopefully we'll get this working. Well, I was gonna record this, but it's really no point. It's literally on mine. One 10 millimeter bolt, pull that flat tab out. Literally, that piece slides right out. And then you just push the other one in. Then you hand tighten, that's why it has that right there. You don't have to use the nut. You can just slide, screw that on, slide the plug on. Now I did check and make for sure the red wire had uh, power on ignition. Double check that, make sure no troubleshoot. Ground wire goes to this cross member here. So, should all be good. Gonna test it here in a minute. Since I got it out, the old one. So, there's just a notch in here. That's that 10 mil bolt with a little plate. This literally seals here. And there's a seal here that goes around the plastic gear. So, this literally just pushes in. You put the little flat plate in, put the bolt in, snug it down. And then this used to have a a flat cable. That's what goes into the plastic gear. This one was broke. It's also been cross-threaded. As you can see the threads of some moron. And then this literally, there's normally a square cable thing that sticks out of here. You just make sure it goes in, lines up, goes into the plastic gear. Standard for Chevy 350 turbos. And then literally you just screw this on. Why this is cross thread, I don't know. This is really light aluminum. They put this on here for a reason. So you can, you know, all you need to do is hand tight snug, you know. And if you're going to use this, you're just doing like about from tight to about right there. That's it. It just doesn't need to be torqued down. That's it. So we'll test it here in a few. I've got to do something else. Moment of truth. I got every gauge working. Except for that one. Let's see if we fixed it.
rattles. That was a big ass school bus speed. I like that driver. Good song.